and this morning we're talking about the Creme Cares diaper drive. Canceled last year due to the pandemic, the annual tradition is back and we're so excited because it supports area families and kids keeping them safe, warm and dry. And we have the lovely Laura Papetti joining us this morning to tell us exactly about the diaper drive and how everyone could help. Good morning. Well, good morning to all of you in the studio and everyone out there. It is a good day when we get to talk about diaper drive because it was tough last year. I've gotten a lot of questions. Well, why, why didn't we have the diaper drive last year? It usually happens at this time of year as we approach Mother's Day. And of course, we were in lockdown at that point and we couldn't safely uh, gather and do our traditional fundraising. And then on top of that, as the year went on, Diapers and wipes were really challenging to get. We just could not order them in mass. So working hard this year, Rosars is coming through as always, helping us get those diapers. Washington Trust is a major drop off point uh, for donations for money. So we're very excited. So we're just happy to celebrate this diaper drive, which is going on now through the night. It's a little piece of what we can all do to help fight child abuse because Vanessa Behan, our partner in this, tells us there's a direct correlation between financial stress and child abuse. So we can't solve this big, huge problem of abuse towards children, but we can all do our part. So here it is, $10 donation equals a week's worth of diapers and wipes for a family in need and takes a little bit of stress off. And let's face it, babies are happier. They're warm, safe, and dry. Who's not happier when they're warm, safe, and dry? So Vanessa Behan is our nonprofit partner uh, in this diaper drive and in this effort. And they keep a stockpile of diapers on hand, or at least what they can on hand to hand out to folks as they come in throughout the year. Last year, people could walk in and get diapers but as those diaper numbers were dwindling, they had to give out fewer diapers. So families might come in and only get a dozen or two diapers at a time. And as we all know, if you're going through seven to 10 diapers a day, which is the national average, it gets really tough. And folks there at Vanessa Behan, they just wanna help people and they tell us people are so grateful. We hear from people too that um, are in a position now to donate that, that needed our services before. I'm so grateful. And again, it comes back to we're all in this together. When we give, there are people that are there that are grateful and sometimes we need help and there are people that help us. So it, it, it's a, we're all in this together. here and boy she sucks it up we are all in this together and all of us sometimes need need a little bit of help uh, we spoke to a woman as we were taping that interview a woman walked in uh, named crystal to get diapers for her grandson who she's currently raising and she said they come every month and they get diapers and other support from vanessa behan so and she told us she's so grateful it she said every bit of it helps so now we just need folks to join us in this effort and we've made it really easy this year because everybody has a different level of what they're comfortable whether they go shopping or whether they want to go through a, a drive up at a bank so here's how you can get ten dollars that's a ten dollar donation equals a week's worth of wipes and diapers you can go shopping at rosars buy your groceries get your mother's day gifts whatever you're doing and they will add ten dollars onto your bill and that money will go towards diapers and wipes so easy to do Find your area Washington Trust Bank. They're all over. Find your neighborhood uh, bank if that's where you do your banking. Or if you don't, you maybe go through the drive up. You can make a, a monetary donation through them. Uh, they'll be taking those and again, turning it over to Vanessa Behan for diapers. And then there's always creme.com. We've put a link there under the diaper drive page. Click on it and give the amount that you're comfortable with. Uh, just so everyone knows. And it's cliche, but it's true. Every little bit helps and we appreciate it because in the end, it's all for our families here locally and all for the baby. So I'll send it back to you guys. If you have any questions or thoughts, let me know. And in the meantime, we hope everybody can join in. Yeah, thank you so much, Laura, for giving all that information. It's just such an, uh, a great thing to do for our community and an easy way to get involved because it really doesn't cost much. So don't forget, if you want to text the information to your phone, text the word diaper. You see it right there on your screen, 509-448-2000, and we'll connect you with the Diaper Drive donation page. So very easy there. Thank you again, Laura, for sharing that with us.